Yeah, hi all. I'm Steve McPherson from Pocono, and this is David McRobbie from Pocono, and we're here with Robin. Come to collect this D814A that um, David's grandfather and his four brothers brought it. The original McRobbie brothers in Pocono brought it in 1957, along with a 463 scoop uh, to, to start on the Mary Mary Power Station. And after that, it did a whole lot of work around Franklin and stuff, and including the building of Pukekohe Stadium. Um, in 1963, it was traded on a D8H, an early 46A for McRobbie's. And then my uncle Bill, uh, William McPherson, uh, purchased it from Goffs in 1963. Um, and because one of the stories was that that blade, that's the original 14A blade, and because all the Stevie's 14 and 50A's only had two U blades on them, which were a lot smaller. And so on jobs and stuff, whenever he took his blade off to run the scoop, Stevie's would be trying to flog his blade, so we actually had to weld his name on it, so we made sure he didn't lose it. Yeah, probably up until the 80s, late 80s, and then it, um, it, it sat at home in Pocono for a while, and then Cousin Gordon looked after it, and um, it ended up in Matamata, and it did a bit of work in Matamata, and then uh, Robin here ended up with it. We've been lucky enough to uh, come down and collect it today to take it back home to Pocono, where it'll meet up again with its original 463 scoop and it can uh, sit with its sisters, the original 14A that McRobbie Brothers bought before this, the older one, and the younger D8H, so they can all hang out together and live happily ever after. <laughs>